<clears throat> so um, I'm not sure where I'm going with this video, but I've just seen a documentary on YouTube concerning the rise of mega corporations in the world and how they are essentially running our lives. Google, Amazon, Facebook, Alphabet Incorporated, and TikTok, and there's all of these agencies and corporations basically dominating everything in the world and connecting everybody in the world linking everything up, providing so much information and it has become so important in our lives to have these corporations in operation. We have Facebook and Google and all these corporations operating and becoming so important in our lives. And it's made me think um, I'm not worried exactly about this situation, but I am stunned. I'm completely amazed at what's happened in the world. It's happened already, but it's becoming increasingly more so. And technology is just taking over. I think they call it big tech. I'm wondering basically where it's all going. Because it's already advanced very quickly from where it began. We used to have just Google pretty much, or just Microsoft rather. And Apple was fairly big as well. And it seemed under control and whatever. Now we have all these giant mega corporations and they're producing so much great stuff for us to use. The technology is so useful to us in life. And we're very happy to have these corporations in existence. Because even though it's hugely changed the world and it's possibly dangerous to have this situation, the benefits we're receiving from their, exist their existence is so great that it's difficult to not be happy with the situation. So I'm thinking that um, there are definitely issues with the way things are and the way things are increasingly going. The giant corporations completely dominating the world are dominating our lives. And it seems as if we can't move without encountering one of these corporations. They're so heavily integrated into our lives and our mobile phones and all of our technology, all of our computing and our internet usage has all exploded and will only become more involved in our lives. So I'm basically wondering as I sit here now, but I've just looked into these mega corporations. I haven't done so before. But I'm thinking, what does this mean for us? And should we be worried? From my first thought is that we shouldn't be worried because this is what's happening and this is what we want. The reason that these corporations have become so huge is because they're giving people what they want. Well, I don't know if I should say what we want, but the point I'm making is that if we are getting what we want, then that is surely good. Even if there are other issues involved with us getting what we want. But I'm thinking that the priority for us is to get what we want in life. All of our technology, our mobile phones, our internet use. We want to be able to communicate. We want to be able to research information. We want to be able to do everything we want to do in with technology. We want to be in control of our lives and we want our technology to integrate with our lives and become almost like an extension of us. 
our phones and computers and whatever, they're an essential part of life now. So they're not just an, an extra. Very important to our lives. And the internet is such a phenomenal resource in our lives. I need to look into how it develops more in more detail. I used to know some stuff, but I don't understand how it could become so awesomely important in life now. And I don't know how to think about it now. It is part of life in a very intimate way, like breathing, oxygen, like water and food. These technology companies have taken a position in life which has become essential to, to, to everything. And it can only become more integrated with our lives over time. And it is completely stunning. And it's just wondrous what's happening. And um, I'm, I'm trying to understand where it might go. I'm wondering if technology integration into our lives is kind of where it's going to be now. Or will it become more integrated with our lives in time? And I'm trying to conceive of how further integration might happen. How will the big mega corporations become even more powerful? How will they have even more influence? I'm just trying to imagine where technology will go. I suppose initially I'm thinking for now that um, we will move away from needing to use a device to connect to each other and the internet and all the love resources. I think we will somehow move to a system that directly connects us to the internet and to other devices. It will be part of our body somehow. I don't know how it will happen, but um, I do think that we won't need a device so much anymore. It will become integrated with us in somehow in some way. And that seems like um, a possibility, even though I can't imagine it for now. There will definitely be more integration with te technology into our bodies so we can connect with each other and connect with the internet far more easily and more intuitively. And no more batteries and battery charging and internet access problems or anything like that. We will be part of a global network more intimately. So it is very interesting what's happening in the world now. And um, I really like where it's going, even though it's strange and sometimes an invasion of privacy and all of our lives, lots of negatives, but the overwhelming positive of being able to connect and research and enjoy life more is definitely worth it, I think.